let's talk about Job Skillshare courses unlimited. Let's talk about what this means. When you become a plus or premium member, you get unlimited access to the courses Job Skillshare team is making. So far, we have uploaded more than 7,000 videos in this platform. Now that's not 7,000 courses because 7,000 videos are all lab videos, course videos, and we're updating it every single day. So this is a very powerful access for our members. When they pay one time, they get unlimited access to it. This means that if tomorrow or after one year, you feel like you don't want to renew some of these services like labs or partner portal courses, then that's fine. You have unlimited access to job skill share courses. Now, what is the difference between job skill share courses and any other courses? Now, job skill share courses are based on title. We create our videos that is relevant to the job descriptions, the current skills. We make unique videos that you may not see in normal courses. Why is that? Because a normal course would be targeting a certification, so they can't really go outside of that scope. We really don't do that in our courses. We actually focus on a title, and a title can be very broad, right? So if somebody say, I wanna become an IT support specialist, this means this person have to learn so many different technologies because that's how in reality it works. So let's go ahead and open this download uh, catalog. We always update this catalog. You will have some indications in this catalog to what we really do in this platform. It's a great way to understand how many active courses are in this uh, platform from Job Skills Share Team. As you can see, it's called Skills Courses, which is kind of why we call it Job Skills Share Courses. And these are custom courses, and you have lifetime access to that. In this catalog, we have created a little indicators for someone to, to understand what kind of course you will be taking and some tips for you. So for example, let's talk about the IT Fundamental V1.0 course. Now this course is designed for someone who's going to be brand new, getting into IT, the first timer. And then right here, we have a tip for you. And then when you see something like this, this image, it's gonna have tip. If you are new to IT career, we highly recommend starting with this course. So basically we're telling people that follow these little tips because that is going to help you. Uh, since these are skills-based courses uh, there's no order you can always go jump to the bottom but always check the the indicators right here so for example if I scroll down and let's say you want to become in a, a systems administrator uh, or you want to learn a little bit more like IT specialist type of skills where you have to do some deployments on a modern technology then you see that the 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 our indicator have changed right here the more you go down you're going to see more advanced courses for example active directory azure course group policy then it gets a little bit more uh, you know advanced and that's how you can actually see uh, the the differences and and have a really nice way or an easy way for you to get started with our skills based courses now this PDF is pretty long. We tell our new beginners that you should really start with the first course over here or the second way is to go to the portal and then uh, inside the portal we have a learning path. You can actually follow that. And here is your login. After login, you will land on our community portal page. Now, I highly recommend you watch this video on the top right corner to understand how to work this whole portal. But to quickly get into, let's say you want to uh, follow a learning path where you don't want to just follow the catalog you can click on get certification right here once you click on get certification this is where it's going to explain uh, what is included in this whole uh, program which is going to be limited courses in this program we're not going to put everything in this program so here's a self-paced program right here you're going to click on it even though you have access to all the courses this is just to get you a little more targeted now so you can see you have step one the same fundamental course that you saw in the catalog um, and that is why we tell people that yes you can have the catalog but if you're brand new then you should start following the learning path like this you can see it's a step one step two and all the way goes down to step three step four and if you want to start this course all you have to do is to click on go to course right here once you click on that, then you will see the home page of this course. And I will tell you how to make this easy for the next time because the first time you just want to know 
what am I doing? What what courses am I following? What program am I following? And that's why there's some uh, step by step procedure to that. So when you come to this page, you are going to see start course green button right here. I already started it. That's why it said continue course. So I'm going to go ahead and click on it. And now you are actually inside the course. Now it's important for you to watch the videos fully to understand everything in our skills based courses because this is where it's different than any other courses. Certification again are small modules they really focus on for passing that exam we we focus on learning the skills so our courses are going to be way longer and way complete than any other courses why because we are not focusing on certification we're focusing on a skill and when it when you focus on a skill it's like somebody's teaching you right on the job and it has to in include a lot of different things from different angles so that's why our courses are going to be long so when you click on the videos make sure to click on the bottom right here and make the unit complete as I already did for these ones so for example if I click on this uh, you know um, uh, unit on the bottom I can click on mark this unit complete and now this course is completed so if you want to go back to the portal and you want to open this course very quickly you can go back to the portal just like that and now when you come to your course dashboard the course that you're taking is going to show up over here I have seen you see I have so many courses I can just click on continue course and this way I have will save all of these steps that I did in the beginning another way is also you can scroll down over here and you can see the catalog right here again so if you want to open a catalog and also if you want to open the same course like for example I just did this one I can continue over here because I did the three percentage over here it, it, it has to be more than one percentage to show in on this screen uh, and that's how you basically uh, go over our courses so make sure you go over all this catalog and understand what courses you want to take maybe bookmark these links if you don't want to go through all of that clicking and 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 but you have to log into the jobsclashare.org first and then open these links because then it's going to make uh, it really easy for you to open these courses and that's how we design our courses you once you have plus a premium membership you have unlimited access to it um, regardless of after one year it's not going to expire we, when we add new courses like azure or any other advanced courses in future you're going to have access for a lifetime thank you